Okay, so we're back. So, people, may I introduce you, our special guest? They are the one and only <laughs> In Sung Choi, my good guitarist friend. Has how's going? Hey. And Rudy Ruderman. Rudy. Hello, hello. Saure a todos. Saure. Man. Oi. Word. <laughs> so, yes. Um, just like how I start off the show, you know, spring. How do you guys feel about the spring? Spring is fantastic. Spring is, yeah, so that we can get our phone like so fucking cold. <laughs> cold uh, weather. Sorry, but watch your language. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's okay. What's up? Yeah, when, when the weather warms up, people start to smile. Right. They go outside more. Uh, you can say hello to people on the street. They don't walk as fast. All the dogs are out. <laughs> I saw a squirrel today. Mm -hmm. it had a it had a sandwich. <laughs> it had carried a sandwich up a tree. <laughs> 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 I don't know how it got a whole sandwich, but it did. <laughs> and yeah, it's it's nice to see everything out. Right, right. You know, um, so um, just to try to make this show special, you know, um, since you guys were my guests, uh, instead of just bringing you guys into this one small room, just instead of three guys just hanging around randomly, I sent you a text early this morning, and it was yes. a special mission yes. that I gave you. I'm going to do this, whoever the guest is going to be the next time, but it's going to be fun. But I mean something that's possible. Was it possible? Um, kind of. It, it was. It was? I think it was very possible. It, I, I did it. You, you did something? I did something. Well, the mission was, um, what would you do to make this special? Since today is the last day of March, what would you do to make this special and meaningful? So, let's start with Insung, shall we? Um, yeah. So, last day of March, and this year was special because we, we have like sushi party. <laughs> oh, sushi party. Yeah. Sushi party. Yeah, I was there. It was too. awesome. Like, <laughs> we, he just. Okay, so here's the thing. <laughs> um, you know, Insung, uh, he's, he's a good friend of mine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What we do, um, we go out and eat a ton's lot of food. And that's all we do, right? Yeah, but we we had a lot of fun right. have, having the sushi. Sushi was was amazing. Um, it was this place called Para Sushi? Sushi, and, sushi we, para. and it was. We had this, you know, unlimited sushi deal thing. Yeah, yeah. It, it's like it's like twenty bucks in. Well, I've done people. this before. It's not like my first time we ordered it, but um, there was something really, really weird about it and bizarre. Um, What's that? Here, Rudy, uh, may I ask a question? How many? Yes, you may. Okay. Um, you've gone to sushi restaurants? A couple. And have you, do you, are you aware of those, one of those you know, unlimited deals of sushis? Endless lines of sushis. I, I've seen signs for like 1995, oh, you can eat sushi. Mm -hmm. But I've never been. No? You never been, you never tried it? Never tried it. Oh, wow. You should try it sometime. But yeah, um, the thing is that once you order that, you know, deal, right? You have to pay around twenty to twenty-five dollars, depends on the person, and they give you this sheet of paper where you check um, food that you want to eat, and food. There's a whole list of sushis and sashimis, right? I do that oftentimes because I'm a heavy eater. And <laughs> usually I can consume, like, at least 20 sushis. Ooh, I could probably do more. You can do probably, you, can, you think you can beat me? I, I do. <laughs> okay, but here's the thing. <laughs> I mean, how many sushi did we, did we order? Like Today? Is, yeah. Today we ordered about... It's like more than 100? It wasn't much, though. I mean, it was just the roll that I ordered. was 16 pieces. Yeah, yeah. But uh, what I guess. but the thing was that here's the big day. What I had with Insan is that there were five people: me, Insan, Jay, Hong, yeah. Ina, which is our film production group. Mm -hmm. And 
each of us ordered what we want. We waited there for like a good 45 minutes because the whole whole restaurant was full. It was packed with people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were, oh. we, no, no. We, were, Sorry. we were hungry. Heck. We were hungry as hell. And then finally we got this table. And we were so reluctant to eat anything we want. Um, we just checked everything, basically. <laughs> and then the next thing you know is that this big, big plate... That's about big as, as big as at least I mean. at least more than eighteen inch. Yeah, if, yeah, yeah. If you if you think about the you know like I'm sure about that white canvas you know eighteen by twenty four. Yeah, it's a little bit smaller than that, but almost big as that. Yeah, and it's filled with endless lines of sushi. There was like, there was I I consider this like such a good gift because because you know the, how much how much time that we spent for waiting was, you know it's like. It's like for like one hour. We were in the heaven. Yeah, we were in the heaven. We were at this enlightenment moment where we see things so beautiful. Since we, that sushi. Sushi. Since we had like a sashimi first. Well, the sashimi was fantastic. Very, it was. It was, it was awesome. good. I wish you you were there, Rudy. Yeah. My mouth is watering. <laughs> My mouth is watering. Oh yeah. Just you guys speaking about it. <laughs> yeah. Of course, it was unbelievable. For the first ten minutes, we were in the heaven. And the next thing you know, you're in hell. Yes, we are. <laughs> we are on the down verge to hell. <laughs> and the bathroom. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I consumed more than at least. I think I beat my record. It was at least like, literally more than 25 pieces. And wow. <laughs> because I was the one who's going to um, buy it, you know, I invited all those friends, you know, and <laughs> it's something that I just have to do because I didn't want to go waste, but. You, you just, came you just had to keep eating. It was like a, you know, it was like a few <laughs> minutes of it's heaven. Like, it's like, and yeah, yeah, go ahead. It was like a few minutes of heaven, and then it's like immediately hell. I thought I was going to be here by consuming all the sushi that I can, <laughs> but I failed. <laughs> I was the loser. No, no, everyone was the loser. Like, like, like everyone is like, you know, since since we were having the sushi at the first time, but we were, we were like in we were like in the hell. I mean heaven, mm -hmm. and then. As time goes by, it's like, oh, I can't eat anymore, <laughs> you know. Uh, but that was the special day, endless, endless line of sushis, and we barely made it, and we're still here, we're alive. But I think that's made our last day of March special in a way, because we're filled with calories, we're warmed up, Feels like spring already. It's feel actually the, getting hot in here. Feel though. the protein. <laughs> so, Rudy, um, what other else? Um, like yeah, mission? Yeah, to, to make it to make a uh, March the yeah, last day of March special. I'll tell you what I did. Well, first, that was, that's a really nice story. <laughs> yeah, and and the month full, and then tomorrow when you wake up, you can go to the toilet <laughs> <laughs> and start fresh. <laughs> and then. And then you eat some more. <laughs> but uh, so I. Yes, next thing, even though you're full right now, the next day, miraculously, you're hungry again. I know, it, you always end up hungry. <laughs> that hunger power, man. Yeah, sometimes it sucks, sometimes it's a blessing. Okay, but today, today when I was uh, in the morning, when I was walking to school, I was looking around and I noticed that on the trees, all the little buds are forming. Mm -hmm. Um, flowers are starting to sprout. I saw I saw some roses in someone's garden. Actually, Ooh. like full roses, red roses. It was, it, was, it was incredible, and I just started thinking about how, through all of winter, like these trees have the potential to bloom, but they're all they're like sleeping. Yeah. yeah. And then spring comes, and it's like out of them come all this life. Mm -hmm. And like that's, I think that's the most beautiful thing about it is that they just come out of like these dead, not dead, but like things that are in a coma. And so I was thinking about how that kind of relates to me. And I, I was always, I'm always tired in the winter time. Like mm -hmm. I'm sleepy. I never want to wake up in the morning because mm -hmm. it's cold. But as soon as it gets warm, like I have so much energy. So, so what I did is, um, since I feel like this relationship with with the plants that around the same time they start blooming, I feel my energy picking up. 
I wanted to just somehow like tell them tell them that that like I'm blooming with you. Oh. And so I wrote I wrote on a piece of paper uh I'm blooming with you. Oh. It's like oh, I'm gonna, and, oh I'm gonna. Yeah, it's cheesy, it's cheesy. Oh, I want to make a song with this. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I wrote on a piece of paper and I buried it in a park by my house. So now the earth knows that me, maybe us humans are going this spring too. You know, I hate to spoil this, but you know, although we did try to make our own special last day of March, the irony is the next day is April Fool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. What if it was like, this whole thing was like a one big joke? <laughs> it is a joke, and you have to laugh about it. <laughs> it's the only way you get by. Well, at least. We still. At least we did something. That's the thing, though. Yeah, at least you did something for the. No, moment. that's very sweet of him already, and you know, I guess sometimes spring do take you to this, you know, stage of romance, you know, and feel like sometimes you really want to do something like you know traveling, you know. <laughs>